Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Uh, now that the Olympics are on, everyone is talking about which countries are doing the best in the Olympics. And everyone thinks of the United States, which has 19 medals right now, and China's got 13, and Australia's got 7 uh, medals in total. And Australia is doing really well, but which country is doing the best? Everyone thinks, oh, okay, it's the USA. But what people are not thinking about is how many people actually live in that country. So, for example, China is second on the list, but China has close to 1.4 billion people. So when you have that many people, it's sort of a bit of an advantage because you have more people to choose from. And sport has a lot to do with um, a bit of natural ability as well. So if you have more people to pick from, then you've got, you've got a higher chance of having someone with that natural ability. So um, what I'm saying is, instead of just looking at this chart, we're going to take into account a country's population. So the first thing we're going to look at is United States. Now the United States has a population of 321 million people and they have 19 medals. So what we're going to do is we're going to find the ratio of population per medal. Population per medal. Alright, we want to work out how many people is it for one medal. So let's go 321 divided by 19, which is about 16.9 million people per one medal. Okay, so it takes the USA Right, it takes Americans 16.9 people to get one medal. Okay, now let's look at Australia. So Australia has a population of 23 million people. Population 23 million. And how many medals do we have? We have seven medals. So we got seven medals. So that means 23 divided by seven is 3.28 million people per medal. So that's not too bad. Okay, it's a lot better than the United States, okay, because they need 16.9 million people to get one medal, whereas we only need 3.28 million people to get a medal. So the smaller this number is, the smaller that number is, the better. Now, Australia is actually not doing the best because New Zealand, which is the country that I also have citizenship for, has a population of uh, 4.6 bil uh, million. Okay, which has increased quite a bit since I left. And how many medals do they have right now? New Zealand currently has two medals. New Zealand currently has two medals. So let's do 4.6 divided by 2, which is 2.3 million people per medal. Okay, so New Zealand, in my opinion, is doing better than Australia, and it's definitely doing better than USA. So yeah, when you're looking at the medal chart, don't forget how many people live in that country. That's what I'm trying to say in this video. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.